All right, here with Lexi Thompson. You were just saying it feels good to be here in Florida, and what a day for you today on moving day. How are you feeling here at the Gamebridge LPGA? Yeah, it's just great to be here, be able to play in Florida at one of our events, and be able to drive to an event is always great. But we've had absolutely perfect weather here, and Lake Nona's in the best shape I've seen. So I'm just happy to be here. Um, you know, unfortunately, no fans, but we have a few members out there supporting us, so we're enjoying every bit of it. What's it like here at Lake Nona for you? Have you played this course a couple of times, many times, or how comfortable were you coming into this week? Um, I've only played this course once, and it was a while ago, but it's just in perfect shape. I mean, it's so pure um, and a challenging golf course. Um, you can definitely get it out there if you um, play aggressively and go after some of the pins, but the greens can be tricky, and you can leave yourself in some difficult um, chips or going for par fives, difficult up and down. So um, it's definitely important to leave yourself with the right spots going into the greens. Despite a couple bogeys, you still had some impressive streaks of birdies there, especially Thank to you. close out the round. Take us through those last three holes. Yeah, it was a great way to finish. Um, you know, I... I hit it great the whole day, the, just the front nine. I got a few bad breaks, but um, that's golf, um, <laughs> a few bad bounces, but I just went with it and just tried to stay positive throughout the whole day with my caddy Jack. And um, we just enjoyed every bit of being out there. And he told me going into the last three, he's like, let's just birdie the last three and get off the golf course. I'm like, okay, <laughs> I'm like, I'll try my best. And it ended up working out. So um, it was overall just a good day. When the conditions are ripe, I feel like this is a course that anyone can go super low. What's it gonna take for you to continue going low tomorrow? Just going out to tomorrow um, with the same attitude that I did the last three days, playing aggressive golf, but at the same time playing smart golf. I don't hit too many drivers out here. It's a lot of three woods, so just getting it in the fairways um, and allowing myself to play aggressive into some of those tucked pin locations and playing smart. And then, of course, one of the biggest stories of the week is Annika Sorenstam in the field. Have you come across her as you're practicing or playing or anything like that? Um, definitely warming up and practicing a bit. It's just great to have her out here, I think. All of us athletes have looked up to her and what she's done with the game, not only on the golf course, but off it as well, and just a role model that she is. So it's great to have her in the field. Uh, I don't know what she shot today, but it's just uh, it's amazing to see her out here and just still scoring <laughs> as good as she is. Everybody knows how amazing of a human she is. All right. Thank you, Lex. Yeah, you're welcome.